Did you know that you can watch any EWW show on demand any time of day? Just head over to EWW-Wrestling.com and for only £6 per month, you'll have full access to over 20 years of British wrestling history. For now though, I'm Stickman McTaggart and this is EWW from the Archives. Have we got two hard-hitting matches for you today. Before we go on though, a quick reminder to like, comment and subscribe to make sure that you don't miss out on future episodes of From the Archives. This week we have two matches featuring the living British wrestling legend that is the Dominator. Firstly, we go to a match at Invasion of the Body Slammers 5 from the Tag Team Titles Tournament. Here we see Dominator and his equally intimidating tag team partner Titan take on the team of Cinders and Danny Blaze. This is Critical Mass versus Blazing Inferno. Look at this, the lights! The Stormonator magic, ladies and gentlemen! The master of the mind game, the Dominator is making Hastings literally pulse! Everybody's waiting for my car scene in the tour check, what's going on? The music's playing, but I can't see him. Oh, hang on! Oh, wait a minute! Yeah, back in Eden Rising, we were sat right here. The Dominator was royally screwed. Titan may have failed to capture the World Heavyweight Championship, but tonight it's a new challenge. He and the British Beast, the Revolution and the British Beast, they could be the favourites to win the entire tournament. I, I, I don't have enough money to get a deposit down for a house. I'd put my house on them winning, and I didn't even have a deposit. I'd be, I'd take it to the bank. I'd buy a bank. I'd give you the bank and put the bank on it. Blazing I'm sure I am of those two men. Who Blazing is gonna... Inferno on the outside. Sorry, Ricky. Go for it. Cinders has not taken his eye off the Dominator. Yeah, Dominator just said, I want you. He's going to have him. Seriously, who would bet against the Dominator and Titan? No man. But look no at man. this, though. Look at this, though. Cinders isn't scared. I think Cinders actually wants some. He wants it just as much as Cinders the Dominator. Cinders isn't scared. That's why Cinders is currently face to face with the Dominator. He's insane. What exactly are you saying? He's on the outside, cowering. He's back in his shadows. He's back in his tinderbox. He's being smart. He's, he's being smart. He's playing, with, he's playing with the Dominator. I don't think he's being smart. He's not in the ring. He's being guided he's, by Danny Blaze. He's taking his time. If you're, 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 you're going to be a man, be a man. Here we go. He's playing with his tinderbox outside the ring. Oh, I'll tell you what. Back to Eden Rising. When Titan got Philip Bateman above his head, did you see the height? Yeah. And that's exactly 
what Danny Blaze and Sinners need to be worried about. Don't just worry about the most awesome force in WWE history. Worry about the other most awesome force in WWE history. I think Danny Blaze has signed his own death warrant tonight. Look at that, and he's Here we go. He's on the outside of the ring. Oh, oh wait a minute. Maybe, Round two, Dominator maybe, Sinners. Maybe your prognostication is right, Jake. Maybe he's not scared of the Dominator, because he's a bloody idiot, because he should be scared. What a bad job. Danny oh, Blaze no. goes. Did you see that height? Blaze became the towering inferno. Double clothesline. Danny Blaze goes over, but Cinders went underneath. Cinders, obviously the heavier man of the team, the more the maniacal. Dominator, the Dominator actually run at them with such force that Cinders couldn't go over the top rope. Gravity was against him. Dominator hit him so hard with that clothesline. Cinders just crumbled like a sack of sand that you find on the Hastings beach. Danny Blaze, yeah, you get on your knees, you stop oh, come on! It was all a plan. It was a plan all along. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Jay, yeah. He's standing toe-to-toe. -to -toe. He's not scared of him. He low-blowed the man. Danny. You don't low-blow a man you're not scared of. Dominator whips into the corner. And Danny Blazer trying to work at the Dominator. And he is tagging in Cinders. It's going to take two men. It'll take two men to hold him. Remember, this isn't, this isn't a no-DQ match. No weapons this time. It's a weapon when you're tired of the Dominator. It's true. Cinders and Danny Blaze should have come with sledgehammers as arms. Cinders is a gas guard top. Dominator's reeling. Dominator's on the, so the Dominator is down. Did not see that one coming, Jake. And there's another tag. World Inferno making. Oh, oh no. Oh, oh dear. Woo! Go! Oh! Huge choke slam by the beast. Someone needs to check his laces because his boots just got taken out because he just got chokeslam right out of them. Uh-oh. No, speaking of boots, that's one of the biggest boots you'll ever see from one of the biggest fans, and here he comes. The evolution of the revolution, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, wow. <laughs> this audience put tickets for Invasion of the Body Slammers fine. Blazing Inferno puts a one-way ticket straight to hell, I can assure you. I'll tell you what, the train ride is bumpy, and there are a lot of bumps, and here come the bumps, courtesy of that absolute gigantic warrior. Huge splash and Cinder's crumbles. Look out, Danny. Oh, he did. Maybe he heard me. Guide Cinder's. Gonna go, he's going to try Irish whip Cinder's. No, 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 I wouldn't, wouldn't. Oh, it works! Back elbow and Cinders has left the giant reeling. Well, referee, do your job. Look at this. What a drop kick. Well, I'll tell you what, it's going to take innovation. It's going to take offense. It's going to take a lot to pull either one of these men away. I don't know, like maybe a knife or a gun or a bomb or a sledgehammer covered in hey. spikes. Two very different individuals, but you can't deny they are working well together as a tag team, Ricky. It's not enough to work well, Jake. As far as I can see it, this is a smoke screen of how this match is going to go. Cinders, is he working on the legs of Titan? He's holding him down, I think, Jake. Look at this. Danny Blaze, he goes up top. Oh, my word! You've got to be kidding me! My Titan, whoa! A two and a half count on Titan! Oh, Jake, I don't think the crowd know what to think. No. Scarlett gearing up the crowd to support Critical Mass. Who reformed just after Eden Rising, just after Titan was screwed out of the EWW World Heavyweight Championship. Sanders, Sanders has Titan where he wants him, and this is a predicament of the Critical Mass right here. Danny Blaze is back up top. How the hell is the referee letting this happen? Oh, wait a minute, Titan. Oh, dear. Oh, no way! He just <laughs> broke it off! And he's calling for the British Beast! And Critical Mass has just reached Critical Mass, ladies and gentlemen! Oh no! Oh dear! Oh my oh. word! DDT! DDT! A count to a million! It's over! Through to the second round. Was it ever any time?
tell you what, we've seen a whole bunch of great tag teams starting off in EWW. What a great time to start our very first EWW Tag Team Champions. Who's it going to be? Is it going to be Alfie Estes and Flatliner? Is it going to be the Free Foundation? Or oh, could it be Critical Mass? Take my money! Take my money, Dominator! Take my money, Tired! I'm backing them all the way, Jake! Two of the awesome! Two of the awesome forces, the most awesome forces in EWW history. Together, same page, dynamite. After retiring the rage at Invasion of the Body Slammers 4, the Dominator was looking for his next challenge. Step forward, Cinders, who challenged the British Beast to a no disqualification match at Eden Rising. Be warned, this one is not for the faint of heart. Oh, you wait till you hear this ovation. The biggest hometown hero there may well have ever been. One of the biggest legends in British wrestling. There is only one. pick up here two very dangerous individuals i'll tell you something there was rumors the dominator was still feeling the effects of that retirement match just back in october i don't think so he looks ready he looks pumped i'll tell you something ricky so he's gonna give he's the armor general he is the armor general the dominator has seen so many wars he basically he's like the british version of sun Tzu. He's the British version of Genghis Khan and Napoleon all rolled into one. This man has seen more campaigns in the Command and Conquer game. Cinders failed to win the title in Invasion of the Body Slammers 4. So, how, what other way is he going to get recognition? How else can he make history in extreme world wrestling by taking out one of the biggest legends there is, was and ever will be? That man, the beast. The Dominator. And here we go, the bell has been sounded. This no disqualification match is on the way. Oh, there's a lot of bad blood. A lot of bad blood left over from the days of Death Row. And Cinders feels, quite rightly, you could argue that the Dominator betrayed Death Row. When he turned on Death Row, went back to the fans. He went back to the people that helped him achieve great, great things of EWW. And Cinders did not like that, Jake. No, not at all. And Dominator, the bigger man of the two. Oh, that's like hitting that wall we talked about that Dominator puts people through. Cinder's back on the off head, sends the Dominator's head into the turnbuckle. Oh, what a shot. And the Dominator did not expect to see him in the corner at this stage in the matchup, Jake. Oh, that's more like it. Reverse that's quickly changed. Uh-oh. Back body drop. Huge back body drop by the British Beast. And, and Sting just sent over the top and what force by that dom line! Woo! And Dominator two. somehow can find the way. Will Cinder's kill the beast here tonight? Oh, do you do? Woo! Cinder's trying to get to his feet. If I was, if I was him, I don't care how maniacal we say it, Jake, I would just stay down. Did he do it? I, I'm not like, as mad as Cinder. Seriously, I don't think Cinder's realised what he was letting himself in for. I really don't. By all means, we're going to make history. Who else than getting in there with Dominator? But probably oh, the biggest mistake of your life. This is the rope to take down the Dominator. Great leverage move there by Cinder's. It's no disqualification. Anything goes. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, Jake Pugh again. Jake Pugh right on cue. All oh, around the ring post. The Dominator's leg. Wrapped around that ring post, and there's absolutely nothing the fans or the referee can do about it except to try and deal with it. We know and he's had some more, knee problems over the years, Ricky. And, and he is working on the knees right. Oh, wait a minute, no. Wait, what the? Is he going to go? What is he doing? Oh, In the my corner. word! 
I believe he's got a figure four on it. Is it a figure four, Jake? I can't quite make out from my position. But I can tell you, I can hear the dominator screaming in the ring. That is something I can hear. And something you do not hear very often at all. He's got the ropes, but the referee can't do a damn thing about it. It's no disqualification. That's that they exactly right. Not only is no disqualification, that implies no five counts. There is nothing up against choking or any move of that nature whatsoever. Oh, wait. Uh -oh. oh, no. Oh, there we see it. Oh, the wait. Crowd. Wait a it's the Free Foundation. It's Blitz a no disqualification match. Oh, no. What have I done? Oh, the Blitzkrieg goes down. What are they doing here? Deadly Nightshade. What are they doing here? That's your mentor. Oh, no, no, blow. And they quickly got. Cinders! And Cinders brings the weapons into the ring! And the Dominator is down and he's helpless right now! I can see how to bear ringside shaking his head in disbelief. He has no idea what's going what's on. The fans have no idea what's going on! On the knee! But Sheen of Metal rattling against the patella of the Dominator. Oh, wait a second. Someone's going to do something about this! And again! He's going to try and end the Dominator's career! And he's choking him out now. Jake, this is, this is horrific. We knew it was no disqualification, but we're talking about the Dominator's career here. His career may have survived back at the last event. Oh, look at that! Desperation, no blow by the Dominator, wasn't it? I spoke too soon. Garbage, take out the trash. Oh, there Cinder. we go. Oh, Cinderella, you shall indeed go to the ball. That dustbin has been... All right. Come up. Time for a sweep up. It's time to swap the decks, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my oh, God! He just broke he that off. Them up. He broke the mop over the man's back. I am in disbelief. Oh, right she, across the head. I can't believe this. He's rushing in the skull of this. Oh, with a shot of his own. Send this fight Woo. back. We said this was going to be a war. No disqualification, no limits. Oh, Jake. Oh, Ricky. <laughs> I, wish we, I wish we hadn't done that little exchange there. Took away from the moment somewhat. Cinder's on the outside of the ring. Went. I'll tell you one thing. His career may have survived at the last show, but tonight it could end here. Oh, no. What's still chair? Earlier on, I mean, Jake, you'll notice, earlier on we saw Cinder's. And he had a chair and he was doing something with it and he was setting it on fire. Yeah, yeah, don't remind me. What a most disturbing bit. Dominator's trying to reach for the... Oh, on the knee, on the knee, knee again! With the chair, the Dominator tried to reach. He tried to save himself. Oh, no. This is a sacrifice. It's all going to come to an end. Cinders going up the top. I, when you see Cinders go up the top rope, Dominator's up! He's up on my willing Oh, oh my God, he it The Dominator saw Cinders coming and absolutely walloped him. He's feeding at home. Oh, he oh. just punched! He punched the chair through Cinder's head and he's on the outside of the ring for a completely different reason now. Don't the try this at home. Complete mastery of anything to do with extreme. We said earlier on in the broadcast that Flatliner was one of the indispensable parts of EW. That man is the life, but that man is the muscle of the heart that pumps around the walls here in Hastings. That may be all for Cinder's. What's that? Oh. Oh my god. I got wait. I can't quite see the Cinders have something in his hand. Oh I just smacked him up. What did he smack him over the head? Oh my god. No no no. That's a pet that's a petrol can. No, Ricky, Ricky. No 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 no. No. Yes. No, no. Yes, 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 it is a petrol can. No. Oh my word! No, you you're not. He's down the you're not gonna. You're, you're not gonna. Not in him. He just Are you thinking what I'm thinking? He's got a lot. No, no way, no way. Oh, thank God. Thank God, referee. Whoa! Oh, no, wait a minute. Oh, no. That was completely Someone needs to restore some order. Please, for the love of God, somebody. That's just got completely one time. Referee, the Dominator is down. He starts to petrol. All hell is breaking loose here at the Extreme Arena, the Hastings Centre in Hastings. The British Beast is getting up. You cannot kill what cannot be destroyed. What? He's got... 
Oh, it's over there. Sit on that twist for all my words. Tape. He's got a table. Cinders has got a table. What's next? Well, it's Cinders fitting here. Dominator looks tired. The referee is out. The Dominator has had so much hit, taking so many hits to his knees. Oh. The Dominator with that fire and that fury. He was trying to mount offense. Oh my god, no. Right, the legs must be tired on the Dominator. Wait a minute. Oh no. Table is set up right in the center of the ring. And Cinders. Oh, Someone's no. going to taste some wood. Wait a minute. Going Cinders out the second Punishment. Wait a minute. What? No. No way. No. Oh! oh! The table. A power ball and the Dolay just collapses. He gave every Took single Took a lot out of the Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait a minute. Cheeks has entered the building. And this is another. Oh, there's a cane. Oh, that's really nowhere. Another former death row member. Another man who fell the drive. He just broke the cane. Right across the head. And there's another referee. No, no way. Can no, no. There? That's a quick count. What the it's hell? over. What the hell was that, Jake Pugh? Sinders has been the beast. Sinders is out of here. Son of a jinx! Jinx has sent a message and it was loud and clear. That was a quick count. Hang on just a second. I'm sure that was a quick count. You have to rewind that. That was a quick count. There is absolutely no mistake about it. Oh, no mistake you about made it. a big mistake, my friend. And the Dominator knows he's done it. Was a quick curl, the Dominator. Lay him out. Yes, DDT. DDT. And absolutely deservedly so. What an absolute travesty. Dominator. A travesty. Dominator was screwed. So that's it for this week's matches. Be sure to tune in again in two weeks' time for the next episode of From the Archives. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit subscribe and press the bell to make sure you don't miss out on the latest news from EWWHQ. Until next time, I've been Stickman McTaggart. Stay sticky.